New Jersey's King Leon coming in to defend us as oh Kings I of like Leon, bro. I love that band. They're so good. <laughs> All right, yeah, but the task of defending the North ultimately will fall to Leon here. He oh takes a okay, first there shot. we go, zero to death. In Let's hilarious go. fashion, fire breath coming through. Forcing Sam Sora just a little too deep as we start things off on Final Destination, which we've already seen Leon rock the house on. And we are multiple hours deep into this top eight, and the crowd still has so much energy. Everybody on their feet, everyone giving it their best year for Leon every time he gets a good hit or a stock. But man, Sam Sora, 140 damage, almost uncontested here, really trying to make this comeback after taking an unfortunate end to his first stock. Now, I guess it's not Town and City, that's what we were gearing up for. But Yeah, maybe it turns they... out both these players can't actually use the uh, the pick band pad. Hey, no surprise there. Doesn't matter, they can press the right buttons when the game is on. Yes, exactly, that's what matters. They're playing with their souls, not with their minds. <laughs> Ooh, and the descending forward air, Sam Sora just staying tricky with what angle of approach he's gonna take. You see Peach floating and you think, all right, I'm thinking X-axis, right? Left to right, but no. She can use that as well as her double jump and just dropping the float and fast falling at any time to really stay so diverse both up and down and left and right. The combo that Sam Sora just utilized in order to get himself back in control, a little, uh, a little roughly put together, but excellent awareness from him. And even more so on Leon, coming in with a down smash just to scoop him right off. Yeah, great way to trap that landing. Went to pretty much the full distance of the claw, waited for Samsora to inevitably hit the ground, and maintains the stock lead. But for how long and by how much is the question? Samsora down tilt to fair, mm, not quite enough. And he's throwing these turnips. That was so effective for him in the winner's bracket set. Leon still missing techs on these. Looks like he's just not expecting them to send him into the stage. Oh, the down air on the way down. Those multi-hits keeping Samsora protected. I feel like Samsora has been finding great ways to get himself back to landing. And the fact that there's no platforms just shows impressive feats by this player. Mr. Saturn makes his appearance. Just a little cameo, though. It doesn't get involved in the battle. Because honestly, it's these turnups that are really stealing the show. Even just the little ones. And Leon just making so many aggressive plays to get back down to the ground, to get off the edge. Oh, and he takes another turn. Man, Samsora basically only played that match with two stocks. And he still was able to win it at a pretty low percent. I don't know, man. This is looking pretty one-sided, especially considering their prior meeting in this bracket. But uh, I don't know. I think Leon still got a chance. Of course, this guy always fighting against the odds. Most people really quick to discount Bowser, especially even us, man, in the Olimar matchup or just against all of the Buzz's characters. We were like, ah, can he beat his owner like this? I don't know. But the combo heavy Peach. Very difficult Yeah, as well. this is a bit more cut and dry, because when it comes to zoning, zoning involves a lot of putting pressure on your opponent, and pressure is not really a tangible aspect. Uh, speaking but, of, we got Dual Zone as the song for this match, my favorite song in the whole game, so props to Leon, who presumably picked this. Yeah, honestly, all the players have been selecting their music, and every single one's just been bangers, perfect to the settings, but irregardless, the, the idea of utilizing like a zoning character and it not working out despite it on paper, it should work, yeah, that's you can see that happening because you could play around the abstract idea of someone putting pressure on you. You can't get out of combos like that. You can't get out of the idea that Bowser is big, he will be comboed, and that's what Peach succeeds at. Ah, uh, just waiting out the flame breath too, fire breath rather. Oh, Sam Sora Ooh, with the bomb. The bomb oh. oh yeah, it spikes yeah, it in, this, spikes game. in yeah. this game. Still catches me off guard every time. Oh, and he got a stitch too? Man, he did that to Mr. E in game five of their set. And I was like, bro, if you don't win when you get a stitch and a bomb in the same game, you Sam just Sora made damn sure to load his dice before this grand finals. I've never seen someone take just the particular amounts of vegetable pulls to get what he's been getting. Shout out to Vinny. <laughs> and Dre. Best friends. Oh, <laughs> got the grab somehow out of that. Leon trailing, but not by all that much. Dada comes through, puts on plenty of shield pressure. Another combo, I, I say with such exclamation, because it's these very strange hits that are getting woven together by Samsora. But you can only really give credit to the fact that he's just super aware of the situation. Oh, Leon stage diving for that forward air. Not gonna pan out. And then he puts himself in the corner, gives Samsora the stage control. No follow up off the landing, weak in air, but still, he is in firm control, nearly a full stock up. And these stray hits from center stage, very powerful, but still not enough to deal with Peach. And you just see Leon keeps going for the side B as a punish out of shield. 
but the 11 frames you have to spend to drop your shield make it a lot slower and just less effective. Sam Sora making sure to stay safe with all of his aggressive attempts. That's one of Peach's biggest uh, factors in this game, right, is she can attack and not have to worry about punishment for so many things. And Sam Sora has exercised that feature so well throughout this set. You see him constantly dashing back, walking a little bit backwards, or more often than not, floating to make sure that if Leon wants to do something to him, he has, to ex he has to utilize his resources. He has to put himself in harm's way. He has to have that risk just to be able to play the game. And it's proving to be more and more difficult as the set goes on. Yes, Leon is able to go for these crazy options. He's able to get these stocks. He's able to keep the battle doable, but it's a very grim story. Yeah, I feel like we've still just seen him lose so many stocks to the turn of edge guards that could have been prevented with a simple tech or maybe a better angle of recovery. And it looks like there's a bit of a learning curve on Leon's end as well, right? Ooh, pick her out of shield. Oh, okay. How's that for Another a one. Out of shield? Oh! How's that for a shield if he tried to block there? All right, Leon still hanging on 130 down, but definitely not out. He's got so much weight at his disposal. Could survive a couple big hits. Just needs to land the big hits of his own if he wants to win here. But before those really matter, he's got to get that damage on him. That's been proving to be the most difficult aspect of this battle for Leon. It's not getting the kills. We've seen him do that in ridiculous fashions that completely defy logic. Uh, he's about to defy some logic right now, I think. Just getting that sneaking suspicion. Oh, the baits. Get Sam Sora to roll in. Oh, wow, but didn't get the aerial approach he wanted. Forward throw. He's going to set him off stage. Not going to kill just yet. Yeah, I love these empty hops from Sam Sora. So crucial. Well, very strange air dodge. Doesn't pay the price with his stock, though, but he is deep off stage as forward air secures it. And Max, we're looking on the verge of a 3-0. Sansor is looking to take the money and run with this one. Man, if we can't defend the North for the first time, then so be it. Either way, Leon has still put on a hell of a show. I'm pretty sure he's won in everybody's heart already. But Sam Sora saying, you know what, man? That whole, like, Moral victories are for minor league coaches. <laughs> Yay already told you we made you, you cockroaches. All right, Max, I see you. All right, here we go. Final destination, potentially the Where final destination of this tournament. You know, I can't even think of another setting that we could see for this situation. I can't see platforms really helping Leon. I can't really see uh, changes in blast zones making his job any easier or more difficult. But something's got to be done about these turnups. He's got to figure out a more secure way of getting in on his opponent. All right, turn up to grab. Just so reliable for Sam Sora. He can punish most anything, even these empty landings from far away with the turnip at his disposal. And then he just keeps the damage coming. A big body like Bowser too, going to be susceptible to these easy, not easy combos, but very reliable combos from Peach all throughout the high percents. I think as far as the combo game reliability has been shown from Sam Sora is that he is in perfect hands when it comes to being able to deal with his opponents. Like, even with the not-as-true combos, even the ones that come out from the strangest of hits, he's still getting stage control from them, and that's what's really mattering here. That's what's proving continuously difficult for Leon. Because he's just eating damage just to exist before he even makes his approach, before he picks his out-of-shield options. He's getting slaughtered. And it looks like he's also unable to pin Sam Sora down with the two frame on that forward tilt. That's been such a money maker for Leon throughout these sets. But Sam Sora not affording him the opportunity. Keeping the pressure up. Ooh, even from the corner escape. Oh, the empty floats just to hop over down smash. Sam Sora looking absolutely unstoppable at this tournament. He's got his eye on the prize, Max. He's already got Leon down to last sock. His play has been pristine entering this point in the tournament. And it's only getting cleaner and cleaner. I think without a doubt it's become clear that Sansor is looking to prove his supremacy for anyone who has doubted his position in the <gasps> top. Wow, the Toad just barely not enough to do it. All right, he's going to lose a stock in the process. Leon still getting the crowd's love. Of course, this is very, very difficult for him to make this comeback. This could be the ending exchange right now. Fair. Oh, Toad again, and I think that's Defend the North for Sam Sora, the Southern Invader. And there he goes, Louisiana born, Florida raised, Sansori taking a very confident grand finals away from Leon. Opposite, by the way, Louisiana raised, Florida now. Yes. All right, Sansora picking up the glass teardrop already. 
He knows he that's his. this tournament he belongs to that. him. Yes, he did. And he's going to get a gold medal to go with it, right? Oh, uh, yeah. This one looks kind of gold, right? Yeah. I, I think so. All right. Well, the crowd the just crowd's cheering, still feeling themselves. cheering for Peach. And he put on the hat. Cut to that. Cut to it. Uh, oh, a he escaped. Slow, a little too he slow. He escaped. Got to preserve his career, right? <laughs> I all don't right. know if he and I would be all right with that one. Hey, man. Well, I've got to go do the award ceremony, so maybe I'll slap it on myself. Um, and I need water, man.